When it comes to body weight exercises for the upper body and core, there are two that stand out from the rest planks and push ups. Both exercises are incredibly effective, but which one is better? In this video, we will compare these two exercises and help you decide which one is right for you. First, we'll start with calorie burn push ups. Burn at least 7 calories per minute, whereas planks burn 2 to 5 calories per minute. That means that push ups are the clear winner in terms of calorie burn. However, consider how many push ups you can reasonably do in a workout. Even 100 push-ups, if you are to do 10 reps for 10 push-up variations, will take about 3 to 5 minutes, that means 21 to 35 calories burnt. Conversely, 3 to 5 minutes of holding a plank mean burning 6 to 25 calories, but there's another frequently asked question that could settle this conundrum. One minute plank is equivalent to how many push-ups? Studies show that holding a plank for one minute is the equivalent of doing 30 push-ups. By that logic, it would mean a minute of planking would be the equivalent of two minutes of doing push-ups. So, if you take this approach, you end up seeing that planks and push-ups burn basically the same number of calories with a negligible difference between them. Remember your diet and how much overall movement you get in a day can affect your weight. Journey more than choosing push-ups versus planks. Muscles worked both exercises work your core, but planks target your ABS specifically, while push-ups target your chest, upper back, and triceps more intensively. So, push-ups are the better choice if you want to focus on toning your arms and chest if you want to focus on toning your abs. Planks are the better choice. Alternatively, you can try different variations to target a specific muscle group if your goal is to build muscle. Belly fat burn planks. Target your abs and obliques better than push-ups. As such, they can build more lean muscle in that area. Push-ups, however, burn more calories and accelerate your fat burn throughout your body because they speed up your heart rate. Therefore, they can burn more fat even from the abdominal area. So planks strengthen and sculpt your abs. Push-ups make your abs more visible, helping to burn the fat stores covering them. Which one is better for beginners? If you're a beginner, we recommend doing planks. They are easier on your body and teach you how to hold the proper form during a push-up. As you get stronger, you can move on to push-ups. Pro tip, it's still best to start with a knee or wall push-up if you are a beginner. For back pain, when it comes to back pain, we often think of strengthening exercises like planks and push-ups. But which one is better for targeting and relieving back pain? In my experience, i found that push-ups can actually worsen back pain for some people because they involve movement. As such, beginners can often arch their backs or sag their hips. Planks, on the other hand, offer more stability and support for the lower back while still providing a good strengthening exercise for the entire core. Planks versus push-ups. So, which one is better? The answer to this question depends on your goals. Push-ups are better for toning your arms and chest, while planks are better for toning your abs if you're trying to lose weight. Planking versus push-ups won't make much difference, and if your goal is burning belly fat, you need both exercises ultimately. The best exercise is the one that you'll stick with, and you can always encourage at both practices into your routine to maximize your results. Thanks for watching. Please also tell what's your favorite exercise between these two. Let me know.